back everybody good morning happy saturday yeah <laughs> uh today we're just going to take the time i got like two hours so we're going to just take the time and do some more side quests because i still feel like i'm just a tad under level from where i need to be um to go on with the next story mission we have so yeah, we're just gonna kill some time with some side quests this morning, and then move on with my lovely day. Um, which normally I would say is a drag, at least when we had to do side things for, or grinding for Kingdom Hearts, it was always a drag. But for this game, uh, there's been like a lot of character moments, and just fun um, NPCs. So I've actually been enjoying the side missions more than I do for most games. <laughs> uh, now I just gotta figure out where, what side missions I want to hunt down for today. Now I'm more over here. I'm trying to figure out. Okay, so it's not showing up there. Uh, maybe on this tiny pathway. There we go. You have the quest. Chain the path. Existence proceeds essence. Oh, precedes, sorry. Um. Man is nothing else but what he makes of himself. Additionally, um, hello? Yes, and you are. Wait, do not tell me. I already deduce that you are here to listen to me expound upon the great mysteries of existence. Well enough, let us begin by discussing the concept of existence, <laughs> existence, pilot, existence. <laughs> I can't read it. Existentialism, existentialism. Sorry. Essence and existence are two sides of the same coin. And yet, what is existence? I'm glad you asked. To answer that, will require many long hours of. There is no point in taking and talking to John Paul. He stopped trying to figure him out a while ago. And he does is spout a bunch of mumbo jumbo about something called philosophy. If you're curious about him, you'll have better luck talking to the flowers. They tend to use smaller words at least. This guy has followers? More like fans, I suppose, but yes. There are quite a few out there who buy with what he's selling. Don't ask me why. Some folks just get into that sort of thing, I suppose. There's even one John Paul follower right here in this village. You know the machine with the thick paint on her face? That's the one. John Paul is no car except her. Melody Collins. Hello, can we ask you a question? Do you happen to know any machine named John Paul? I certainly do, Master. John Paul is a genius. You can rely on him for absolutely everything. And we talked about the same John Paul here. In fact, I was just thinking about how much wisdom he has to teach me. So I wrote him a letter asking me for guidance. You'll take it to him, won't you? Huh? I can't let that lady in the desert get to him first. 
or that park, and then you can park. Great. There are more of these weirdos. And wait, they have genders? Obtain a letter for John Paul. Hello? Ah, yes, I see. Dreams are the mind's version of reality perfected. Hey, John Paul, we have a delivery for you. Ah, allow me to see it at once. Interesting, a letter it is. A female machine asked us to deliver it to you. She said she could rely on you, and that you know pretty much everything. Yes, yes, now if I may, do you believe that existence precedes essence? Um, is this about the letter? Oh. Right, but shouldn't you maybe respond to the letter? Is one duty bound to reply to every question spewed in their direction? If such is your claim, then what power was it who placed the burdensome yoke about my neck? This is a waste of time. You got that right. Uh, are we going back down? Sure. There you are. Well, what did the master have to say about my letter? Actually, he said it wasn't worthy of a response. I know it. Isn't he the greatest? I can't get enough of him. You don't say. Unrestrained apathy that. Can you please just take this present already? A gift? Let me see. Here we go. Ah, uh, yes, fascinating. The machine gave this to us. The, mach the machine that gave this to us said you were both suspicious and alluring. It seems this so-called gift is nothing more than a piece of unadorned glass. Therefore, I can only surmise that... Um, do you want us to bring a message back to the woman who gave this to you? For a mere trifle, no! Okay then. Let's go. Ugh, oh, now we have to do the desert now, don't we? Uh, This is such a... I know it sounds like I'm complaining. Oddly, this is very funny. 
just not what I thought our first mission was going to be of the day. Did you give my gift to Master Jean-Paul? I must know what he said. Well, he said it was a mere trifle. Such insight, such truth. He sees to the poor of things in a way others do not. I shall follow you for the rest of my days, Master Jean Paul. That's a long time. Oh, I'm so glad that was it. Now to the desert. Oh, God. Um, well, this is a fight. Or not. Interesting. Machine of Love. Uh, hello there. At? Huh? You came here from Master Jean Paul's village, didn't you? I can tell. I can smell him on you. Ah. Uh. Okay, that's weird. Jean-Paul is wonderful. He pursues new knowledge with a passion that is almost indescribable. I admired him as I do no other. You have issues. And you clearly lack a discerning eye. I bet men take advantage of you all the time. Not exactly. Ah, right. I found something that Master Jean-Paul is sure to be interested in. Please take it to him with all speed. A to B. I've been thinking about something. What? Do you think this fellow is being a little too... I don't know... glorified? That's certainly one way to put it. Indeed. Is there any purpose or need to the objects we find in the world? Consider, if you will, this place, or this village, or even myself, is such a... We're here with a present for you. A present? Of what sort? It's a fossil. Oh no, my boy. It's a fossil. Uh, one of your followers asked us to deliver it to you. I see, I see. You said you were indescribably passionate when it came to learning or something like that. A mechanical fossil? No use at all. Do you want us to tell her anything on your behalf, or... I'll not waste words on mere junk. Junk? Bleh. John Paul doesn't seem to appreciate these presents he's getting. I suppose we should go tell his followers exactly what he thinks of them, huh? They'll be waiting for some kind of reply. Oh, was I supposed to do... That's funny. I somehow managed to do this out of order. So I was supposed to go locate each of the robots first give them all the presents, and then go back to them, and, um, tell them that he doesn't care. That is funny. Huh. I would not have thought to have done it any other way than how I did. Okay, one last time. Um, housing complex. Come on. Up the hill. Ah, now you decide to slide? You know, wife machine. Was it always called wife machine? Why are you here? No, you're machine love. Oh, okay. You there, delivery boy. Pray tell what Master Jean Paul thought of my present. He called. No, yeah. He called it a useless piece of junk. Such cruelty! 
I've barely the words for it. When I think about his wanton sadism, it makes me... Ooh. Blah. Updated, please just be done. Despite being rejected by Jean Paul, his followers made no attempt to see him for what he truly is. He began to question the overall meaning of the relationship. Oh, now do I actually go back to Jean Paul? This is exhausting. He doesn't care at all about anyone but himself. And yet his followers just keep talking about how great he is. What's the point of all this? And what's he even getting out of it? Maybe you should ask him. Where's Jean Paul? Let's talk to the non Jean Paul. Oh, hey, you again. If you're looking for Jean Paul, you're too late. He set out on a journey. A journey? Huh? Yeah, he said he needed to go find himself or something. Oh, but he left a letter for you here. Hey, that means it's over. EXP gain up three years. That's pretty cool. If only I had the space to put it on. Oh, and Beast Hive. Oh, that's great. Well, he's nothing if not consistent. A weirdo right to the very end. I wonder if all his followers being female had something to do with his weirdness. Did the human sexes interact with each other like this? Who knows? However. Let's go find out what that one is. Hello. Hello. Welcome to the amusement park. Here's your stamp card. If you collect all the stamps, you'll win a free prize. You'll find the stamps inside the amusement park. Make sure to search high and low. And just between you and me, I hear that the prizes are more than just free. They're deluxe. Off you go then. Good luck. luck and have fun. Ah, uh, okay. So at least it highlights the areas. The problem is, I don't know what the stamps are supposed to look like. Oh. Is there anyone? Stamp discovered. Yep. It is advisable to recover as many of these collectible items as possible. Proposal. Imprint the stamp upon the card. You mean stamp it? Oh, 
Found a choker, really? Wow, I really just got lucky with that first stamp because I have not seen that. Creepy one. Hide it. Right time. Stamp. Hide it. Creepy machine. Yeah, I said you're creepy. Um, I'm gonna go back to the center because I think the other ones are going to be off in that split direction. So they're not. I got over here, so better get me. This is where that musical boss fight was. And some other boss fight will be, apparently. Please don't tell me she's back. She was hard enough the first time. Uh... -huh. 
So far. What did I stumble upon? I can lie, little creep. This is really weird. Easy for you to say.
I'm not even sure how to process everything that just happened. Oh, the, they seem like they were sick. Like, it was supposed to be a weird zombie moment, but yeah, they were sick. There were a bunch of other. Uh, dead robots down there and then you have the weird TV tower wow I just don't know how to process that that was such an odd one especially for being a stamp mission yeah I don't I don't know what to think about it just yet I don't know if it was just like this fun little gimmick or if I need to read into it a lot more Fascinating. I do think I also did that kind of out of order. I feel like that might have been the last thing I was supposed to find. So I, I expect these other two to go a lot smoother, but yeah, that was very odd. I enjoyed it, but I'm not sure what to make of it just yet. Discovered. Alert. All stamps have been obtained. Proposal. Return to the entrance and secure the promised deluxe prize. Deluxe, huh? Hey. Hey. Here you got all of the stamps. 
Great job. Did you enjoy your time here, or maybe not? Well, it doesn't matter, though I'm sure you realize that by now. Whether or not, yeah, you enjoy something simply depends on your own heart. This place is but a mirror that reflects one's true self back at them. Anyway, here you go. One deluxe prize coming up. Come again any time. Nice. Precision. Oh, precious earrings. I thought it was precision earrings. Like, what the hell is that? Large recovery, fast cooldown, which is nice. Money's nice. And over a thousand XP is great. You bet I like that. Cool. Um. 